Hello there, and welcome to this uh, special birthday uh, event uh, in Minecraft for David Rosen and uh, Jeffrey Rosen of Wolfire Games. It is today their birthday, and we're going to celebrate it in Minecraft just as we did uh, with uh, me uh, and uh, Anton in the past. Woohoo! Yeah, yeah. And we're doing this on the Mine Lord Minecraft server. And. Uh, yeah, I should probably introduce all the people that are in here, because uh, we are a few people. So first up, we have me, of course, Lucas, and uh, and Anton, you're here, right? <laughs> hey guys, I'm here again. And then we have uh, Glenn. Yep, that's me, Glendin, Glavit, name it. <laughs> and uh, then we have, of course, David and Jeff. Say hi, guys. Hey, ready? Huh? What did you say? Hello. Yeah, hello. Oh, I hear Jeff. <laughs> hello. Are you there, David? There you are. Yeah. Hi, guys. And, uh, of course, once again, thanks to Windlord and his uh, Mind Lord Minecraft server for giving us the uh, the server that we can do this on. In the first place. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Well, basically, <laughs> Lucas, we just see the logo. Idea. Yeah, I know. Yeah. Switching to the, okay. uh, to the Minecraft now. Nice. There we are. So in the bottom right, of course, you can see uh, David, and to the left of him is Jeff. So, so we can catch their reactions when they see their <laughs> gifts. <laughs> and uh, now Pretty I think exciting. I'm just going to leave this to uh, Glenn to uh, take us through all the creations that people have made. Nice one. Well, we can start out with seeing this lovely room. That's well, I started making it, and then it got severely warped when other people added some things, like this hovering <laughs> block and the villagers behind you. And of course a welcoming cake, so that the first message that, that you may see is indeed, happy birthday, have some cake. <laughs> awesome. If you're still hungry after that, there's plenty more outside, believe me. <laughs> if you're wondering why Anton and Silverfish are wearing golden helmets, that is because those are the closest thing we have in Minecraft to party hats. Inside <laughs> this chest over here will be some more hats, if you'll be wanting them. Just to get into the spirit, into things. And Diablo Deck Doc is standing in front of the sign you will need to change game modes to put them on, because you can't put them on in creative mode. This is a flaw in Minecraft. I can hold it there. You can right click <laughs> oh, the sign. Uh... Right click would help. <laughs> I can fix that, no worries. <laughs> Thank you, sir. My sincerest apologies for breaking your house. No worries. All right. Can you figure All right. it out? Shall we keep moving? Or do Got you want to put the on? Got the hat? Yeah, yeah. And you may walk down there to view the outside and see what we have made for you. Whoa. <laughs> That's quite a cake. Indeed it is. Nice wolf fire logo. walk past your first present. The big red one over here. You should definitely walk inside the present. <laughs> yes. Don't run off, Jeff. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I need I need some help. Okay. I'm in. Whoa. Here we are. Take it easy on that. Take it small, guys. <laughs> Fire guys. <laughs> oh, this is very nice. Nice. 
plenty of signs for you to read. Little messages from everyone. And nice paintings as well. <laughs> yeah, this is super awesome. Cool. Thanks a lot, guys. Yeah, it's our pleasure, pleasure for yeah. sure. <laughs> <laughs> The giant wolf eye logo you see, I see here is a little creation of mine. Well, it's the biggest creation of mine, to be honest. <laughs> Though, of course, I did do this pixel by pixel from a Photoshop template. <laughs> I like the anti-aliasing. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, very fancy looking. Yeah. Yeah. And basically, there is a lot to see here, so there's not really a particular order to see it in either. So if you'll just walk up to whatever interests you, I can tell you who made <laughs> just it. Just notice the black shades, man. What's that? Just saw the black shades, man. Over there. He's pretty cool, right? <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> yes, black shades, man. Dude, where'd you go? Yeah, I'm following yeah. Jeff around. I feel like we got split up here. <laughs> oh yeah, I'm following yeah, Jeff around, around too. Around. Oh, there's oh, David. Jeff. All right, I'll follow David around if you follow Jeff around. And, and Aubrey's <laughs> here as well. <laughs> and Aubrey's here also. You keep getting pelted by somebody. Is that the <laughs> Wolfire disc golf disc? This is very yes, it is. bad etiquette. Huh. Nice. And if you go if you go up on top of the Wolfire. Uh, Disc golf disc. You'll see what it's uh, headed towards. Whoa! It's the humble indie bundle. Oh, <laughs> nice. <laughs> <laughs> there really is a lot to see. Let's yeah, see. There's the um, Black Shades Man. Was made by Sid and Nusis. <laughs> that is amazing. Whoa. In honor of the Black Shades game and yourselves, of course. He's got a ladder in his head. <laughs> you can go yeah, inside. Go inside. Go inside. <laughs> okay, going down the ladder. There we go. <laughs> so many people. Oh man. Inside. Oh, it keeps going. <laughs> <laughs> this is super epic. Let's see, where did you go, Jeff and David? I'm like I'm... in the left foot of the Black Shades guy. <laughs> oh, okay. I'm still following yeah, David together right outside. Yeah, yeah I He's found like David. like the Trojan Black Shades man. Yeah, the disc is that a taser bot? The that disc is. was made by Sid with the Wolf Eye logo again by me. And the basket was made by Aaron, T Frutis, and Jagalink. I don't think I've seen a Minecraft muzzle flash before. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, where, oh, okay, I'm at, I'm at the taser bot. So, someone should uh, make it dark so you can really see the muzzle flash. Done. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> that is super sweet. Yeah, let's see, the taser bot and the gun are by... Can't see them on my list. Ah, oh, there they are. By Lorcan! Has a glowing camera also. <laughs> From the Wolfman <laughs> Forest. Does it does have a glowing camera. That's Lorcan's work right there. And Mr. Otten has made some birthday music for you. That is next to the, 
next to the disc golf thing. Or oh, David go. Just saw the Broadside Express. Yeah, I'm at the Broadside Express installation here. Uh, the Broadside Express. <laughs> this one is actually not on my list. I don't know who made that. <laughs> I think Steel Raven. It's crazy to see at life yeah. size. Steel Raven made the board set experience. Yes, Steel Raven. There is a sign declaring his name on it. Which I must say, that popped up out of nowhere in my mind. <laughs> Which yeah, is pretty it amazing. Yeah, it did appear quite suddenly. And you might see that it is about to crash into the hex crease from the red shards map. <laughs> <laughs> Making it already more damaged than it is. Whoa, whoa. More damaged than it already is, type of thing. Also, near the cult, between the cult and the cake, you may have noticed some pixel art that looks like Turner. That's it's the Easter egg again. Agree. I, I see that too, David. <laughs> That's funny. That's cool. I've got a little ra rabbit village set up for you. <laughs> Whoa. It's supposed to be reasonably accurate, or at least as accurate as we could get to Aubrey's rabbit home art. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Of course, it's very hard to do round things in Minecraft. What are these little glowing things they keep picking up? Experience. Orbs, that's a Minecraft thing. The thing that they were pelting you with in the birthday room was experience bottles. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it's a sort of confetti in Minecraft, you know, gotta improvise the Yeah, that's what we, what we use it for anyway. <laughs> the rabbit home interiors are cool. Oh, yeah. You can right click the door if you want to open it, Jeff. Ah, oh, sweet. Very crazy. Yeah. Uh, the Rabbit Village project was led by a demonic demon. Yeah, this is really impressive. I tried to help a bit, but I think I messed, messed things up more than I helped. <laughs> <laughs> David, where'd you go? Jumping around on the rabbit house. <laughs> oh, it's the overgrowth logo. Yes, it is. Nice. <laughs> With an epic turret behind it. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good turret, that. Both the turret and the overgrowth logo were one of the... Well, were some of the last things to turn up in the last few moments. So I don't know who actually made them. The vines um, on I the overgrowth logo are cool. Very overgrown. <laughs> I believe the turret was made by Lorcan, Sed, Silverfish, and Tonjevic. Yes, Tonjevic, Sed, Silverfish, and other people. <laughs> it looked Tonjevic like being my alter ego. <laughs> the other Anton. He's Anton, I'm Antone. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Nusus did the overgrowth logo, he says. And there's the whaleman too, sporting a party hat, a party <laughs> fizzle thing that you're blowing up really doesn't know what it's called, and a glass of beer. Nice. Party whale, man. Yeah. We'll find some signs down below his feet proclaiming that he is approves of this party. <laughs> Excellent.
I'm gonna jump into the water here. It's <laughs> probably the coolest Minecraft beer cup. <laughs> that is definitely a great beer stein. Yes, it is. It even has a handle. <laughs> yep, very well made, I have to say, actually. The foam just looks so real, man. Real. You can almost lick it. <laughs> almost. This this is liver down here. Yeah, a little moving contraption made by Fox. Used a lot of redstone. It's pretty loud. <laughs> <laughs> yes, it is. You can turn down the sound in the options if you if you want to. Happy beef day. <laughs> I couldn't really fit birthday on there. <laughs> Just cool. I didn't know you were right here, you fine. find some more pixel art, and I'm wondering if either of you will actually recognize what it's supposed to be. Looks like someone's been shooting arrows around here. <laughs> yeah, I think someone have been actually. It took me a while to understand what this pixel art was. I don't think I had it. Yeah. Where are you guys? We're in front of the pixel art. Is that lightning shadow? Yes, it is. Awesome. Ah! I knew you'd get it. <laughs> David recognizes his one. own game. <laughs> You didn't think or you didn't hope. <laughs> <laughs> Can nice. I UI is there. <laughs> I don't think I ever was able to play that one. It. Cake itself. Where do you guys go? I'm lost. I think we're up it's above cool the, cake. On the cake. Yeah, I'm following you around, David, so so it's okay. Oh, should I go? You may notice Jeff? that the cake has a dark half and a light half. <laughs> <laughs> this, of course, a reference to the title that uh, Jeff has always sported on the forums, being the evil twin. That means the darker, slightly more evil-looking side of the cake is yours, Jeff. Oh, thank you. <laughs> I'll just hang out on my side. <laughs> and you'll find there are candles around the edges which you're allowed to punch out. Blowing being it something is. not integrated <laughs> into the microphone. <laughs> Don't forget to make a wish. Might have to turn the lights off if we can. Yeah, should we? You should make it nice so we can see the lights glowing. <laughs> nice. Nice. Now, if this were a race, I think this, it would be appropriate Blowing to quote the tortoise and the hare here, because Jeff is going through them quickly but sloppily, and David is going through them very slowly and accurately. <laughs> It's funny. It's working on my actions per minute. <laughs> That's what it sounds like. Click, 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 click. <laughs> Someone's coming around relighting them. <laughs> They're trick candles. Uh. There you go. Spider web frosting is cool. It looks like the cake is made of small cakes as well. Is, is that the case? Yep. <laughs> wow. There's thousands of tiny cakes. Is it bad to catch on fire? <laughs> I think you'll make it. 
Generally, catching on fire is not something desirable, but in the creative <laughs> mode of Minecraft, it can be excused. <laughs> Yay, Jeff got there. them all. <laughs> I don't know if you happen to notice the little booth on the top of the giant wolf fire logo. There's a little surprise waiting for you there. Yeah. Alright, heading to the wolf fire logo. Um, Note the sign. <laughs> That's nice. <laughs> He's got quite a bone collection. <laughs> a special dog like Wolfie. Well, he needs to survive up there, you know, for a long time, so... You'll note he has a food bowl and a water bowl. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. That's super cool. <laughs> oh, no, I pee everywhere. Don't start with the bottles again, guys. <laughs> Cheese fire! Oh, oh no. I accidentally punched him. No. <laughs> Run away. <laughs> oh, he's escaping. What's next up? It's funny that you're seeing this cloud of flying people. <laughs> uh, have they seen their throne yet? No, I don't think we've been to the throne yet. Jeff is looking at SpongeBob. <laughs> kinda on the, he's kind of on the way to the throne. Oh, oops. Still need to punch some stuff. Easily fixed. So, uh, yeah, just follow the path to the left there, Jeff. Towards the receiver logo? Uh, away from the receiver logo and then left. Just follow me. Or follow a dog, whichever is easiest to see. <laughs> Um, yeah, this is here's, here's your thrones to sit in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sweet. Shed, get off the throne. <laughs> <laughs> Where's David? There he is. Oh, he's adding a seat. <laughs> it's a ship. <laughs> Someone put a boat on the throne to make it sittable. Didn't work. <laughs> Not quite well. <laughs> this is where we bow and grovel, yes, John Jebek, exactly. <laughs> grovel, grovel, grovel. Grovel, grovel. Yeah. This is pretty awesome. It's really nice. I feel like I'm in Clockwork Orange. <laughs> I must admit, Jeff, we did. Uh, I, I I did let a little thing slip. If you uh, look behind the uh, the throne, there's a tall glass there for you. <laughs> Indeed, there is. Shouldn't stand in the fire, Jeff. Not good for you, man. <laughs> Where am I going? Oh, uh, I'm inside the throne room now. 
Oh, yeah, behind the throne room, there's a big uh, martini glass. Apple tea, in fact. <laughs> <laughs> Lots of cookies. Lots of cookies. So. Thank you for the apple teeny. <laughs> That's Windlaw's creation. <laughs> but after I let it slip that you liked apple teenies. <laughs> <laughs> or at least you did at New Year's. <laughs> yeah, no, apple teenies are great. <laughs> Appletini is Windlord's creation indeed, <laughs> as is the humble Indie Bundle logo, <laughs> and the knapsack is made by, uh, who did the knapsack, let's see. Sid. Very nice work, like the, the whole logo and the knapsack, everything looks very much like the original. <laughs> <laughs> but I just noticed that the receiver logo glows. That's really cool. <laughs> it does. Thank you. Yeah, that's Antone's creation. <laughs> that Behind the receiver logo is also a small item of note, also by Antone. <laughs> it looks pretty cool when there are so many people on and everyone's just floating around in there. <laughs> <laughs> like a swarm of the bees or something. So, uh, Jeff, to make this work, you have to come to the end here and push this button by right-clicking on it and then run along as the lights turn off to hear the song. <laughs> I think I know what this is. <laughs> nice. <laughs> Definitely getting some lag from the... Uh, from the um, a number of people on here, so the timing's not perfect, but... <laughs> nice. That is awesome. Yeah, they're really cool. So, for, for the, like... To John. <laughs> yeah, for the three of you that don't know what that is, that's the uh, Humble Bundle music. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, really sweet. It it um, flows very well for me, on my end at least, even though there are a lot of people on, so... That's good. It's all good, that means the stream gets it properly. Yeah. Yeah, sounds perfect on my end. Nice. Yeah, mine too. Very it's well a little, done. It's a little jumpy on my end. <laughs> very catchy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. Someone put, get down. It's good. <laughs> no. Get down. Get down. Fantastic. <laughs> awesome. Have we had everything yet? Um, I'm not sure they've heard Happy Birthday yet. Ah, yes, they haven't heard Mr. Rotten's music yet. That would be near the disc golf goal. Yep, yeah. underneath the disc golf basket. <laughs> I just noticed the giant disc golf basket here. That's pretty sweet. <laughs> it's it's actually a great view from up on top of the wolf fire disc. It looks like uh, it's going to land in the disc basket. I'm climbing on the humble bundle bindle. That uh, disc basket is so tall, like I walked past it several times before I noticed it. Like right, <laughs> right next to it. <laughs> yes. I didn't recognize the hex crete until uh, <laughs> Glabbit mentioned it. <laughs> I'll just not mention in giraffes at this point then, shall I? Uh, David and Jeff are on top of the disc thing. Disc golf. Yeah. Disc golf goal. Disc golf goal. Disc golf goal. Disc goal. Whichever it is. The tower. Let's just call it the tower from now on. Cool seeing the redstone light up. Uh, David's here. Wolfie's still angry. 
<laughs> yeah, people should learn not to hit dogs. <laughs> Who would do something like that? Of course, this is Wolfie, so I suppose you could say he's staying in character. <laughs> well, I'm inside the disc golf basket. This is, it's like a stair system in here. Oh, it just fell off. <laughs> no. <laughs> With a mine cart, I think you can actually ride down it. Yes, if, if you type slash warp space coaster, then you warp up on a, a top thing where you can grab a mine cart and start the roller coaster. Oh, wow. Okay. Oh, somebody pushed me off. I'm falling. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone were up there when he said it. So. Uh. How do I activate roller the uh, roller coaster here? What's that? Are you stuck? Um, do I want the minecart with chest? Yes, you take a minecart and then you hold it in your hand and then right click on the tracks to place it and then you right click on the cart to sit in it. Okay, let's see. You need to sit in it pretty quickly though, because the red redstone track will send it plummeting forwards. <laughs> Actually, I can stop it doing that. Just uh, sit in it. Oops, time to make sitting in it. <laughs> okay. okay, I have a cart. Just right click on it, oh, so you're sitting in it. There you go. Whoa. Nice. Can I go after him so we can catch it on the stream as well? Uh, oh, yes, you oh. can. <laughs> Someone, <laughs> Someone blocked him. <laughs> you got pushed off center a little bit. Yeah. I got a great little shot for the video though, so that's good. <laughs> There was about 10 empty minecarts rolling down after you <laughs> landed. <laughs> oh, I see. Joe Shadow is just dropping minecarts. <laughs> well, when there's less people around to push you in different directions, it should work quite smoothly. Get up, it says on the sign. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. Can try this again. Oh, oops. Whoa. Uh. How do I get in the cart? Right, right, right. right, right, right. The okay, I'm in. <laughs> Whoa. That works pretty well. Quite a ride. Oh, I'm not really working on this. Speed, speed bottles. The joke's done. Yeah. How long have you guys been working on this? How long did this thing take to make? Not too long. I think the construction of this goal tower took less than a day. I just sort of sprout up from the ground. It wasn't me who made it, so I don't know how long it took exactly. Well, is that a character? Of course, the road coaster itself took some revising because it didn't originally work very well. Yeah, it looks like a carrot. It's a, it's a carrot <laughs> next to a pixel art uh, turner that I mistook for something else the first time I saw it. <laughs> <laughs> Which apparently is an inside joke by all the Snickers. If you don't pay attention, we'll, we'll know what he mistook it for. OG2D. <laughs> mm -hmm. Is there anything that we haven't, uh, that they haven't seen yet? Uh, not on my list, I don't think. 
Yeah. Receive logo, humble any bundle, throne, cake. Logo. Was there anything in the green present? present? Oh, the green present. Yeah, there were a few signs in the green present. The green present was made because I thought he might not have enough room in the red one. But of course, that turned out to be a bit of a disappointment. <laughs> Aww. Someone just wrote this as creative. Overestimating how much of the community actually had Minecraft. Or time to play Minecraft. Well, same thing. <laughs> <laughs> having and having time to play Minecraft, same thing. Okay. Oh, there's a castle. Uh, above the castle receiver that sign. Sprouted up. <laughs> that was not on my. Ah! People are I got putting stuck in spider webs. webs. For some reason. <laughs> <laughs> we'll be stuck in a spider with the overgrowth cake shrine. Yeah, a couple of signs. OG is the best <laughs> thing ever. <laughs> Yay. <laughs> So we have the castle still? Yes, there's the castle near the receiver logo, to the left of the receiver logo, in fact. Yes, so... Yeah, well this is super awesome. There, should, you, there is one last thing, I think. I think it's the, um, the castle. Yeah, it's to the left of the receiver logo. So... Ah yes, and there's the wolf fire. Someone made a terrible pun. <laughs> yeah. We'll look at that in a bit. More cake and more thrones. <laughs> oh, yes. Can't have too much thrones. cake and throne. Exactly. Nice. And angry wolfie. <laughs> Sweet. Oh, and this one has suitable seats. Nice. Yeah, this is very luxurious. <laughs> very comfortable. Indeed. Lovely. A good feasting hall. Oh yeah, I mean, I'm standing on the cakes. That sounds very nice. <laughs> You silverfish feet in my cave. <laughs> <laughs> Eating it up. Whoa. Sorry, I ate all the cake. Very yeah. tasty cake. <laughs> <laughs> Not a snacky cake? What's this flying thing? <laughs> <laughs> well, uh -oh. in Minecraft, that is a ghast, one of the most terrible enemies you could ever face. But currently it is not a ghast, but someone masquerading as a ghast, so you have nothing to fear. <laughs> um, was there anything else? Someone said something about a, a dog dispenser or something? Ah, the wolf dispenser. Wolf dispenser? Wolf dispenser? Yeah. Yes. And now gas and each form that will be What's happening? I'm talking oh, no, magic no. away the gas. <laughs> That's the noise this man. Yes, it is horrible noise. Cut off the gas. Now from what I remember, I think I heard that uh uh, oh, no, I can't think of his name. C418, who made the music, also made the sound effects, and apparently that was something that his cat, some sound his cat made, manipulated or something like that. Yes, before manipulation, that was a cat noise. I heard that too. I have no idea what he was doing to the cat at the time. <laughs> <laughs> I think the small white uh, thing in front of the cake is uh, the wolf dispenser, correct? Yeah. correct? Yes, I think so too. Do you see it, Jeff? Um, yeah. Alright, heading over. If people could step back and give him some room so you can see what happens. Oh. A bit further back, guys. Moo Moo, back. 
<laughs> Alright, I'm gonna push it. I think I see where this is going. Quite a little fire. Yes. You can stop. Oh, it's terrible. <laughs> <laughs> How many are there? <laughs> Far too many. Uh. I think the gods are not amused. <laughs> Wolfie is the last wolf standing. Very appropriate. Better take shelter in the rabbit huts. <laughs> Yes. Was that uh, the whole uh, the whole tour, or did we miss something? Yeah, I think about we've done most everything right now. So what's left is for them to go off on the road and explore all things that they want to inspect closer and check if they haven't, haven't missed all the signs. No, have if they have not missed any signs. That's what I mean. Yes. Yeah. So so I'm I'm guessing we will we will stop the stream now then. So. Yep, I'll probably stop my recording now too. Okay. Okay, fair enough. So, so I'll yeah. make it clear one last time. Happy birthday, guys. <laughs> Thanks. Yeah, happy uh, birthday. Thanks. It was great. And hope you have, have another good year to come. <laughs> of course, yeah. most of us would want to add productive to that line. <laughs> <laughs> Looks like a dragon. Okay, but but mostly, I'd like to say, have a good year. <laughs> yeah. Happy birthday, guys. Thanks. thanks. And uh, thanks once again to to Windlord for creating this server. Um, that's mindlord.net, right? Or com? Or com. Mindlord.com. Mindlord 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 yeah. The site is mindlord.com, the server is mindlord.com. You can't miss it. Yes. So thank you for watching, and uh, we will see you in the next Upgrowth Weekly and in the next uh, birthday event, too, of course. Yep. Yes, you will. Bye, everyone. See you guys next time. Bye. Bye. See you. Bye. Bye. Salute.